Quem? Sim? Isso. Hum, you understand the question. No, no. <laughs> oh, wait, I'm reading it. Is it B? No. Mm. Yeah, correct. But you don't understand. Because the area is representing displacement, right? So if yeah. the, the, same, the amount of displacement is the same. I want you to label the point P, Q, R, S. P U V W. Yeah, the object, you have an object, and you have the ball. The ball is bouncing on the floor. Correct? Mm -hmm. Please draw the point very speed. Okay. Very speed. Q R S T U V W. This is okay. Can you draw another one for me? Why? I can't draw it. Draw what? Uh, this springy thing. Okay, okay, okay. 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 E very good. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, very good. Q is slightly before the impact. R is slightly after. Mm. T is slightly before. <coughs> U is slightly after. W is slightly before the impact. Yes. Mm. Wait, I thought I thought S was here. S is the highest point. Wait, ah. Uh. 
between Q and S, the time, the difference in time is very small. So between Q and R, they are almost they are almost the same point. Oh. Yeah. yeah. See, they are almost the same. They they almost happen at the same time. It's like almost vertical. Wait, but it why just... does Q drop to R? Q. Oh. Q drop to R mm. because this one they take positive downwards. So Q is still downwards. R is upwards. But that's why the the graph doesn't go up as high anymore because the velocity decreases. Yes. When it hits the surface. Yeah, they lost some kinetic energy. Yeah. They lost a little bit of kinetic energy. Yes. Mm -hmm. So like that. Yes. So that's the explanation. So T and yeah, T and U is almost the same time. Almost just See, we spend a lot of time, but it's okay. Yeah, you understand. No? 